then. So there's collectibles all over the game. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes. Uh, is it gonna be a quick time event, I guess? Not bad. Nice shooting tits. All right. Thank you. I'm, I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Not, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No. What are you doing? How could you do that? Chris, that is so effed up. What? That poor little cut was alive about 10 seconds ago. Oh, come on. Squirrels are just rats with bushy tails. I cannot believe you just did that. Ah! Oh, my God. Get that. Get it away. <sighs> Jesus, are, are you okay? This mountain is freaking me out already. Hey, hey, look. Our, our cable car is coming. Let's grab our ride. What? The squirrel's fine. He's just a little lightheaded right now. He's perfectly fine. Is that a ladder? It must be really hard on Josh. I I don't know how he keeps it all together. I, I mean, I'd be a wreck. Well, we're all just gonna have to keep an eye on him. Must be going through so much, and he seems. Like the kind of guy who's uh, Swix, not thank you just for ask something. for help, you know. Thanks for the yeah. support. Well, let's go ahead and adjust a couple of settings real fast. We're gonna go ahead and turn this down just a hair, and then turn everything else up. It'll even out a little better that way. Can we go in here now? Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked. Keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Is that a safe back there? No. After you. Oh, real gentleman. Yeah, again, I haven't played this before, so please, no spoilers, don't do... Please don't do that stuff like, Oh my god, you should've did that. Oh, damn it, he did the wrong decision there. I or, the car was oh my closer. god, this next part's gonna be awesome. Those kind of wait. comments. I'm please try to, to minimize those. Time if you have to type range. them, open up your notepad and type it in there. You? That way no one ever sees it. It's a big mountain. Thank you, yeah. Thank you very it's so much. It's beautiful in the day, but at night just feels menacing, like a sleeping giant. You gonna publish? What? Your pretty poem. The sleeping giant of the Blackwood Forest. Oh, fuck What a crazy place to set up house. No matter how rich you are. Not so rich. Family Hotel Potter. and sanatorium? What the fuck? there. Trying to look for pumpkins. There's got to be pumpkins hidden around this place somewhere. 
They fit in Halloween pumpkins. I gotta find them. Where are you? Where are you, hidden pumpkins? I know you're here somewhere. Sanatorium and sanitarium are two different things. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. Let's look over here real fast. Nothing. All right, let's go. Let's have something horrific like happen. Like the prom. How is this like going to the prom? This was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So, I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off a train bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Boom. This game is obsessed with butterflies. Ugh. Mike's new girlfriend? Oh, God. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Time to meet and greet. <laughs> okay. Oh, God! What the hell? Jess, hey, Jessica, Jesus. over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please oh. let us out? Pretty please? Fuck. That was so fucking loud. Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. Ashley, Mike's in, if you know what I mean. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know. What? Whoever. Whoever. 
Sam? Whatever. <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Looks pretty flat, to be honest. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge, like, right where the cable car ends? Emily Mike's ex, resourceful, persuasive. I don't think it would have been, like, as pretty. Fucking mad. Uh, thank you very much to D12 for the $15 tip that says boo. Ice Badger for the final tip that says good shooting text. God damn, I love yoga pants for the $20 tip. Um, thank you guys very much. Thank you to Emperor and App Apollo for the win for the subscriptions, <laughs> the holiday subs. And Emperor Morg and Carbon and Swix and Rudger. Thank you guys for the brand new subs. You guys are fantastic. And thank you. Hope you guys are having a happy Halloween, by the way. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? So, so this is the jock. And then the slutty girl, or the ditzy cheerleader, or both. So we got our horror tropes. She's gonna die real fast. He's gonna die. Actually, he will die first, and she will see him and die and go. Instead of being quiet, you know, in the closet hiding, she's gonna be all like, ah! and the killer's gonna see her, and then she's gonna she's gonna like. Run away. She's gonna fall down and do the back backing up on the ground thing instead of getting back up, you know. It says she was intelligent. <sighs> she chill. wishes she was intelligent. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Yeah, I'll just carry all your shit, you know. Definitely not gonna Whatever. be like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Oh, stop! Jesus! Fuck! <laughs> God damn it! Fuck you, Mike! Hope you get a fucking gonorrhea. Oh my God! God, I'm gonna kill Mike. He's fucking dead. He's fucking dead. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Cool! Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, uh. just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like this. <laughs> Throwing his ass. Michael, you gotta step off. Emily and Step I are together up. now, and that's just the way it is. Mm -mm. I'm not gonna tell you again. Do we understand each other? Well, I thought maybe we can move past all this. Be buds, but yeah, fine. Mike. No, 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 it's totally cool. I'm just gonna head down the road, be all mature and shit by myself over here. Peace. I think you got the message. Kinda hot when you get all alpha, you know that? Step off. What? Step off. Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Um, uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. I just really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Em, I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Um. Okay. Fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. What a fucking bitch. Jesus Christ. God damn.
Ashley has a crush on Chris. Academic, inquisitive, forthright. So many people to kill. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. That is not cool. What is going You fucking lying bitch! No! Oh, God! <laughs> hey, God whoa. damn it! Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to Fuck. scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real. Jesus scare you. God. Oh my gosh. Hey, wow. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. No. Um, sure. Uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. All right. Son of a bitch! Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, okay, listen, it's probably nothing. But nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... Damn it! Matt. Oh, God. Uh, read that book. Check the phone, baby. <gasps> Jesus. Oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. The hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> Boo! Oh! Ha <laughs> ha! Hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Whoop. Oh, ah. gotcha. Hey. Oh, snap. Got it. <laughs> Hello. Come on. <laughs> hey, Mike. Boom, shakalaka. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, you got me. Fair <laughs> <laughs> Random music. Sometimes doing nothing is the right me, thing to Michael. do. I know all your tricks. Whoa! Ah. Gotcha. Right. Point just. And then what? Oh, ho. no more. Oh, oh yeah, oh more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> oh, gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Get some sexy time, baby. That cheating. Wow. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lot. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Mm. 
what? If I'm playing the girl, I want to get the D, right? So I'm trying to get that D inside me. That's what you do. Hello again. Oh, hi. Why are you meeting at and night? How are we feeling? Hmm? I'm feeling just dandy. Seems we hardly scratched the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. <laughs> this time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Uh, thank you very much to uh, Triple P for the $10.31 tip that says, Thanks for a great month, Dan. We appreciate all you do every month. And happy Halloween. Thank you and happy Halloween to you. Uh, Accursed Sloth, thank you for the $10 tip that says, Happy Halloween, Dan. What does a ghost eat for lunch? A bouloni sandwich. Oh, my God. Um, Sacrificial Yoshi twipped, tipped $20 and says, Now we see why Mike left her. Dan Duck, Dan Bitch. <laughs> uh, Chase tipped $5 and says, uh, Hey, Dan. Um, my girlfriend em Emily and I are huge fans of the stream. Happy Halloween. Well, thank you. Thank you guys very much for the tips. You guys are fantastic. And thank you, uh, Clifty Clap, for the resub. Um, women worry me. Planes scare me. Crowds scare me, definitely. And fear heights, fear drowning. Kind of both. Let's do drowning. Rats or snakes? Snakes can actually kill you. Rats are just gross. He's taking notes. Guns or knives? Uh, definitely guns. Snakes or cockroaches? Ooh, fucking cockroaches. Why is it snakes again? Uh, definitely snakes. Clowns scare me or scarecrows? That fucking clown is ridiculously scary. Holy shit. Gore disgusts me. Crows are scary. Mm. Gore is gross. Oh, God! Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. What the fuck was that, you prick? Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> oh, well, I'm afraid 
once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. What? That guy's freaking creepy. Five minutes ago. This is a little bit. Oh, come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Boom. I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? That feels the same to me. Josh, Hannah and Beth's brother, also known as Mr. Robot, on the TV show. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's got to be like a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, Cochise. Cochise? Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. Hey, baby. Uh. You doing all right? Yeah, aside from being kind of cold and vaguely creeped out by this place. It's, it's kind of weird being back up here, huh? Yeah. Okay, let's, uh, let's follow Mr. Robot. This game has been jump scare galore, like crazy. Ashley's looking pretty hot today, right? Who's looking pretty hot today? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? You want a what now? No. Absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like... That could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. 
You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. 